Hey guys, welcome to day six of our DIY Christmas event. I hope you've been enjoying everything so far. I'm loving sharing these ideas with all of you. They really are so simple and it's a lot of fun to make your own gifts for people as well. And you don't have to be especially crafty or creative to do this sort of stuff. It's not like sewing or anything else. So this is just mixing some beautiful ingredients together and creating something really lovely for the special people in your life. So today we are doing a beautiful, luxurious facial serum. So for yourself, for any women in your life, they will love this serum. So as women, we are all used to putting so many lotions and potions on our skin. We do it from when we're a teenager. We're told that we need certain products. We need to, you know, anti-aging and anti-wrinkle and whatever else. But most of these products have very questionable ingredients. So they might be helping to improve the appearance of the skin, but they may have chemicals in there that are affecting our hormones and affecting our overall well-being. And really, if you've got essential oils, you have everything that you need to pamper and nourish your skin and make it feel amazing to improve the appearance of your skin. And of course, you're getting those beautiful aromas as you're doing it. So it's a really lovely way to pamper and to nourish yourself every single day. So I'll be popping the link up to my Beauty Detox ebook. So this is normally something that's just for my subscribers, but I'm sharing it for all of you today too because it's very relevant and you'll get a lot more information in terms of you know, customizing products for your skin type in terms of the oils that you use, um, both the essential oils that you use and the carrier oils that you use. You might wanna make some different choices depending on your skin type. Um, so yeah, you'll have a lot of fun with that. I've, I made that a while ago and I'm getting some really great feedback on that. So I'll pop the link up for that. So make sure you download it so you can kind of learn a bit more about this and extend your knowledge. Um, yes, so facial serum. So you can buy bottles. You can get all sorts of bottles, whatever shape, size, color that you like. But my preference is to reuse my bottles. So don't ever throw your empty essential oil bottles out. If you've got empty bottles, you have a resource that you can use um, for gifts. So I'll just show you, I keep mine in an old doTERRA box, funnily enough. Um, so this is some of mine in here. Um, so hang on to your bottles. They're a really great thing to keep. There are all sorts of ways that you can reuse them and this is perfect. So this is just an empty 15 ml bottle and I've bought a little dropper top for it. So absolutely perfect for making a serum. My recommendation would be to use an empty bottle that is an ingredient for whatever you're making. So if you're making something for your skin, saving an empty lavender or frankincense or geranium or ylang ylang, one of those types of oils to use to make your serums in, means that you don't even need to wash out your bottles. So I'm all about things being easy and I don't wanna to have to wash the bottles if I don't need to. So the labels peel off quite easily. You can soak them if you need to. And then you can use a bit of lemon oil or eucalyptus oil on a cotton ball and just wipe away any sticky excess and you'll have a beautiful clean bottle um, ready to put a new label on or you can tie like some string, put a little gift tag on it explaining what's in the bottle and how to use it. So for our facial serum, we're gonna use a 15 ml bottle and we're gonna use two carrier oils. I'll say that, but I use two carrier oils. I use a blend of uh, sweet almond oil and jojoba oil because that is what works for my skin. So once you've got your ebook, have a read through and there might be a better carrier oil for you. I don't tend to use coconut oil in my serums. I use it in my cleanser, but not in the serum that's getting left on my skin. So you can have a play with the carrier oils and see what's gonna work best for your skin type, but I'll just share my basic recipe with you today. So 15 ml bottle, we're gonna add 20 drops of essential oils total. So the recipe I'm gonna give you today has four oils in it, so five drops of each. But again, you can customize this to do whatever you want it to do for your skin. So if you've got blemish prone skin, there are certain oils that you would use. If you have mature skin, you'd use certain oils. If you have oily skin, you'd use certain oils. So you can really have a play with this and customize it for yourself or for whoever's getting this beautiful gift. So my recipe that I'm gonna share with you today is a blend of sweet almond oil and jojoba oil, like I said. 
and I'm going to use five drops each of frankincense, lavender, myrrh and yarrow palm. So frankincense, myrrh and lavender, you guys are going to be familiar with these three little beauties. So myrrh oil, if you don't have myrrh yet, um, this was the free product of the month uh, last year and because I'm pre-recording this, I don't know whether it's going to be the, the oil of the month for December yet. Hopefully it is. I love myrrh oil. I use it in my uh, cuticle oils, among other things, because it's really great for your nails. So great for your skin as well. So lavender, frankincense and myrrh. And the last one was yarrow palm. So this was released just at convention in September. And I have completely fallen in love with this oil. It is amazing. So this is a blend of yarrow essential oil pre-diluted in pomegranate seed oil. And the reason they've done that is not just to dilute it, they found that there's active ingredients in both that synergistically work better when they're combined. And it's been amazing for my skin. So I've been putting, I don't know if you can see very clearly, but I have a scar on my forehead where I had a um, skin cancer removed last year. I've been applying it directly on there. I've been applying it under my eyes and it just seems to take away that puffiness. Um, and I put it in my hydrating serum as well. The, from the Virage kit, I put a couple of drops in that as well and get it kind of everywhere. So when you're making this serum, if you don't have Yarrow Pom yet, it is available from this week in the US store. And it comes in a bigger 30 ml bottle with a dropper top on it. So it's really easy to dispense out. If you don't have Yarrow Pom yet, the next best thing I would choose is Blue Tansy. So they're both blue oils. And if you've seen these before, but Blue Tansy is like ink. It's so dark. Um, the Yarrow Pom is blue as well, but it's not as dark. You can see it's blue on the top there. Um, absolutely beautiful. So five drops each of frankincense, lavender, myrrh and Yarrow Pom. So in your bottle, top it up with your carrier oils, give it a little shake around and you have an incredible serum for your skin. And the thing is, we would pay $60, $70 or more for something like this in a department store, easily. And we can make it so simply and quickly at home. This will take you 30 seconds to whip up and it will do amazing things for your skin and for your mood. Uh, whoever you're gifting this to, they will absolutely love it. As with all of our DIY products, because we don't have any um, uh, preservatives in them, you might want to add a few drops of vitamin E oil into your products. This would be something, something that you could do that too. So you can just buy vitamin E capsules. Make sure it is just pure vitamin E though. Pop the capsule open and add a few drops. Vitamin E is incredible for skin as well. So any skin product that you're making, you can just pop open and add a capsule of vitamin E oil and it's going to help extend the life of it and it's only going to do really good things for your skin as well. So yeah, really, really easy. So once you've um, watched this, make sure you grab your copy of the Beauty Detox ebook. You will get loads of recipes and loads of ideas of how to customize these products for your skin. Um, we didn't talk about Salubel, but Salubel would be another great option. You can pop the top off your roller and add a few drops of that and make a Salubel serum to give to people as well. That would be beautiful. Um, and obviously it's already got frankincense, lavender and myrrh in it. Funnily enough, these are the oils that are so amazing for our skin. Um, yep, so we're gonna leave it there today. Amazing serum, really easy, really luxurious for yourself or for anyone you're gonna gift this to. Make sure you're reusing your empty bottles. Um, these little dropper tops are really easy to source online if you just look up essential oil bottle dropper tops. You can get spray tops and pump tops as well to fit all of your five and 10 and 15 mil bottles. Um, so if you've gotten value from today, please give this video a like, um, tag anyone who likes to make their own beauty products and we'll share this information out to as many people as we can. So thank you so much guys. Make sure you get your ebook and I will see you same time tomorrow for another Christmas DIY idea. See ya.